what is up everyone this is Karan here welcome back to tech Karan youtube channel if you've ever heard about the fluid os this is also an usb based room which has the android 10 version we're waiting for android 11 based rooms but we didn't got android 11 based much till now with some customizations also and yes we've installed the fluid os which is on the most customizable not this has no customizations some little bit of customizations are there which i'm gonna share with you it's almost same like all AOSP based rooms still now so we're gonna take a look at uh, the quick look at this room right now and this may be one of my shortest room review till now on my channel as this room does not have any that much kind of things i'm just gonna share with you some quick things about this build which you get here which are the things perfectly fine and some customizations nothing else so make sure to watch this video till the end let's get started quickly Okay guys, this is AOSP based room which has a pixel look by default, the home setting is a pixel launcher pre-installed and also comes with the Google Apps pre-installed. It's available for Redmi K20 Pro, Redmi Note 7, Redmi Note and these kind of devices also may be available for some other devices also. It has the styles and wallpapers app so that you can install a lot of wallpapers if you want to. Also we have other third party apps if you want to install them, you can simply install a lot of wallpapers and by default the wallpaper looks very interesting. You can simply install any live wallpaper from here also and i'm using this wallpaper this wallpaper looks very good and if you know about this this wallpaper is from the google pixel devices that looks very interesting the quick settings panel here looks like the same other AOSP based rooms which has some of these kind of things and you doesn't you don't get any extra kind of quick setting tiles available here too some little bit of tiles like the screen cards heads up and sync and these kind of things are available but the thing which is missing from here is a screenshot tile this that is missing maybe if instead of screen record you should put the screenshot option there it's in my opinion because screenshot is one of the most useful thing and i personally use that instead of screen record on my device so i would rather recommend the screenshot instead of screen record so this thing may be a little bit of thing good for you for not also if you have noticed we have the volti icon on the status bar so yes volti is perfectly fine here which is very easily working including the icon but yes you cannot customize this icon also let's move on to the settings first of all Moving on to the settings with the network and internet apps and notifications, fluid customizations, battery display and if you have noticed we have these icons little bit of theming available. I don't know how, why, whatever else but little bit of theming available here and also you can customize your themes from here. By going here you can customize a system, customization, ASIN color, icon shape, status bar icons and clock styles etc and other things are kind of the same thing where you can customize your fonts etc a little bit of status bar customizations are available quick settings and navigation bar customizations are available nothing extra to customize little bit of customization features are available here we also have the things where when you go to the display option you can adjust the dark theme we can use the styles and wallpapers if you want to the display size you can customize the fonts and icon shape the same kind of things which you get in AOSP based rooms as expected storage privacy location also in security if you're using redmi note 8 you have the face lock option available but maybe for some devices from other devices maybe this option is not available for you other things are kind of the same using the full screen gestures is fine here you cannot hide the notch this option is also missing from here as you can see no notch is hidden but as yes, the full screen gestures are perfectly fine here also you have all the main features of google pixel device like you can install these apps by easily from the google play store without having any issues so this might be the very cool thing you can install the gcam also nothing else to think about this build but let me show you one more thing if i go to the google play store if i go here go to the settings option my device is not certified i don't know why even if you have noticed i don't have the magisk manager installed still device is not certified little bit of disappointing thing for me i don't know why how and whatever else these were the things i just wanted to share with you as i already told you this might be the shortest quick review of on my channel of a custom room because this room does not include anything new anything else almost same kind of things as in usb based rooms so this is all from today's video i hope you like it if you like it don't forget to click the like button and uh, thanks for watching goodbye have a nice day